So this card is operating off a 5 volt power supply and it's just using a USB cable connecting to this USB connector which is plugging into a little circuit board that plugs into the banana plugs. And I want to talk about that briefly. So that card looks like this where it has a USB connector on it and two banana plugs. Uh, these banana plugs are not designed to be mounted on a circuit board. They're designed to be right angle connectors that have a wire with a little set screw here. But they are gold plated I think and they really solder very well when you solder them to a card like this. The diameter of this um, post is uh, 6.8 millimeters and when we look at the bare card here, the diameter of the holes is 6.95 millimeters, but you can see that the traces going to the USB connector are huge. We've just uh, made a large, I don't know if I can get the light to look at that, but um, I've made the traces just huge going, going to the banana plugs to try and reduce the impedance between the USB connector and the banana plugs. And there's a little extra, extra connector here, uh, just a two pin 0.1 inch spacing, um, which we can see here is just a, another way to connect up instead of using the USB if you just want a 5 volt 2 pin output or in fact any other voltage um, because this is going to a variable power supply you can get any voltage you like here and of course this allows you to vary the voltage to your USB device if you want to test it at different voltages and see where it drops out or something like that so I'm going to put the design files and Gerber files on the attach them so that you can have these built yourself if you want to just keep in mind that you have to get banana plugs that fit these holes properly I had trouble getting a right angle banana plugs so <laughs> that's why I wound up with these things I think eventually I might cut um, the post down so that it's the uh, same high as the USB connector so that we don't have a huge um, post sticking up sometimes getting in the way I have three of these right and uh, I can make more if I need them but they're really handy I've used these all the time now because I use 5 volts so much one thing I need to mention is that the little spring tents that are on these banana plugs that give them a uh, good fit to their mating connectors is that they, when you heat them up enough to solder them into the the card, it seems like the, that wafer or that spring gets a little loose in here. So I've actually soldered this end of the way the uh, springs um, to the connector so that they're never going to come apart. And that's a pretty useful thing to do. And when you're soldering these, uh, it's best to plug them into a mating and a jack so that uh, we get the the pins to be exactly parallel. 